When the opioid epidemic hit home, a Warrenton woman fought back. Now she's helping hundreds of others and saving lives. Fox 2's Dan Gray shows us how she is our Pay It Forward Award recipient this month. Kelly Clodfelter understands she will live with pain and grief every day for the rest of her life after losing her 17-year-old son to a heroin overdose in 2014. But she also lives with joy and hope, knowing that she has helped other young people turn away from drugs. Her friend, Lori Simon, surprised Kelly with our Pay It Forward Award, a $500 gift card from First Bank. On behalf of Fox 2 News and First what? Bank, <laughs> oh my God! I would like to present you with $500 to pay it forward for your outstanding work with Jordan's Place, the youth in our community, and the tireless work you do to make sure that no other life is affected like yours was. Kelly got the surprise as she arrived at Jordan's place in Warrenton, a youth center she started after her 17-year-old son Jordan died of a heroin overdose four years ago. Since that day, she has been 100% committed to making sure that that does not happen to any other um, family in this community. So she opened Jordan's place to give a safe haven for the kids in the community. On any given night, about 45 teens gather to play games and hang out. It's a safe place for teens. I wish my son could have had somebody to turn to in those moments. I really do, because apparently I wasn't that person for him in that moment, and I wish that he'd have had a second option. Jordan's death wasn't the only tragedy Kelly's family faced in 2014. We lost two children within five weeks. My three-month-old daughter passed away at daycare. She was laid down for a nap, and she didn't wake up. And then five short weeks later, Jordan picked up heroin for the first time, and he passed away. Um, if you can only imagine what that could possibly do to an entire family. Uh, my husband and I just, we had to find a way to bring beauty out of this. Turning pain into power to help kids stay off drugs. Watching her fulfill her dream of honoring her son um, has been amazing. Tonight's Pay It Forward Award is brought to you by First Bank. If you would like to nominate a deserving person for the award, go to fox2now.com and look for the Pay It Forward page. I'm Dan Gray, Fox 2 News. Organizer.